Hey guys, and welcome to Jurassic Room. And let's see, we're gonna play the Dynasty again. Yeah, you might have seen uh, the previous playthroughs I did. Uh, that was when I had to use two phone cameras to uh, record. Way like a year ago, even two years ago, something like that. And yeah, I actually really like this game. I played through it like seven times when I first got it, just because I could beat it 100% easily. But, uh. Yeah, we're gonna go ahead and play through it again. I got it on the PS4 this time. It was only eight bucks on eBay, so it's like, yeah, we'll go ahead and get it. We'll do a playthrough of it, and maybe later on I'll play some Arkham Knight. But I just wanted to give it a little, go, little bit of a go, and also want to test out these new uh, headphones I got with the new microphone. So, okay, so we're just going through the title screen right now. You know, this this isn't a completely bad game. It's more so for just fans of the of the show, but. Uh, Get through this whole credit scene, and then uh, we'll go. We'll go. It actually, had some interesting mechanics for game for uh, hunting and so. I think it would have actually been good if this game got a sequel, or like under the Duck Commander logo. Hello, Dinah. Are you speaking? Hey, Dinah. Okay. All right, we're about we're gonna, we're gonna jump into this. Yep. New game. Here we go. And then of course there's the mini games, boat racing and galleries. And then there's all this, which I think at the end of the series we'll do the extras, which is the uh, extra content, which is the uh, psychology uh, 101 thing. The uh, Uncle Psy trivia game. And as I like, got the credits, got the season 5 DVD trailer, scoreboards, the e-manual license agreement, and the extra content, which is the trivia game. But right now, we're not going to focus on any of this stuff, we're going to focus on the main story. And here we go. And it should be much more clear now that I've got the uh, capture on the PS4 instead of the uh, using two phones. Um, one facing me and one facing the TV recording. Ooh, <laughs> the, the graphics. <laughs> man, oh man. When you got it, you got it. And let me like tell you, I definitely got it. Pre-2010 hey, uh, Cabela's game. You better watch out. Look, those little suckers are nasty. And numb. the bed bugs were so bad that you'd wake up on the floor because, hey, they'd toss you off in the middle of the night. There's so many things wrong with that statement, sir. I'm talking about having it. The like, gift, other than uh, the Cousin talent. Bo there and uh, Willie, the, duck call the rest of them just sound like they're reading right off the script, oh, which I can completely grief. believe. Here we go again. I'm just saying. Oh, you ever wonder what perfection table. sounds like? It sounds a lot like this. Squawk, 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 squawk. It's like poetry for the ears, isn't it? Oh, come on. Hey, I'm just trying to teach our new intern, John Luke over there, a thing or two about duck calling. Gentlemen. Bum, 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 bum. Hello, Willie. Party pooper alert. Whoop, whoop. Yeah, that's funny. What's going on in here? Let me guess. Working hard to complete that order for the big boss. Nah. Shocker. Actually, I was just showing the ropes to young John Luke over here since he wants to work with us someday. <coughs> hey, I'm all about that, but you know it doesn't take just a strong work ethic. In order to succeed here, you have to be a well-rounded Robertson inside and out. Well, mostly out, as in outside. That and an awesome beard. You'll get Insert there. picture of me now. Just listen to us. That's right. Look at I Cousin the Bo over there. He was in your shoes not too long ago. Wanted a summer job and whatnot. That's right. I was exactly where you were at. Didn't know anything. Hey, what's changed? It wasn't easy. He had to bust his tail, learn everything he could about being a full-blown Robertson. Not listen to Jace. And eventually, he earned his stripes. Now look at him. Bam. Now he gets to be as miserable as the rest of us working under this tyrant dictator. I wish you would actually work. Anyway, CB, help out old John Luke here if he has any questions. Definitely. You need help? 
I got answers. Tell us, CB. What's it like working amongst the duck call community's most elite? Sai, stop picking your nose with that. You're gonna hurt yourself again. Hey, when you got a booger way up there, you need to dislodge it somehow, or it'll dam up your nostril like a beaver dam. And hey, eventually, you'll never breathe again. That can't possibly be true. I think I got it. And the textures of the beard. But where'd you go? <laughs> I lost it. Phil? Hello, Phil. Hey, Sai. You got something in your beard there. Looks like you got a beard booger going on there. This hey, was sold for fifty dollars. I think Phil? my mom paid well, fifty bucks for this for Christmas. <laughs> We're getting ready for the big dinner Sunday, and I could use some bucks, assistance like from five you years boys later. and hunting and whatnot. Ducks, Jeez, squirrels, frogs, you name it. If you kill it, we grill it. Know what I'm saying? Hey, you don't have to ask me twice. I'm in. Although I'm usually opposed to skipping out on work, I actually think this could be a good opportunity for John Luke to learn the ropes. If you want to work up here one okay, day, wicked. you're going to need to be a well-rounded Robertson, See me. starting today. Hey, Keep the up. more the mayor is what I always say. There you go. And the more food we get, the more happy everyone's going to be. To sit on my Let's lap. do this. John Luke, you can come with you me. Say? You need to hey, learn duck here. calling 101 taught say? by none other than the best and most handsome duck caller in the business. Yours truly. Glad to see you haven't lost your modesty, Chase. All right, see you boys over there. Yeah, it's kind of funny. What about the... our order? We got to finish it. We'll do that later. The commander has spoken. Yeah, Willie, we'll do it later. Hey, John Luke, I'm going to come with you guys. I can give you advice and help out however I can. Si, you have something in your beard. No. Yeah. No. Yes, you do. No. How would you see anything? Oh, wait. You're right. Another boogie. The dam has been broken, boys. They just keep coming. Sal, that's nasty. Hey! I got my dog and the pudgy cat up here. <laughs> kind of funny that they chose Cousin Bo, but I got him to be in the game. I would have figured Jeff would want to be in the game, considering he's kind of a game or like a game enthusiast himself. Most of y'all probably will not know what I'm speaking of. Unless you've seen the show. It is hilarious what happens later on with the daggum beavers. <laughs> Those beavers look mad. Yeah, they get revenge on us later. Okay, and here's the scroll. Like I said, this isn't... A bad looking game like uh, if they made like a sequel to it or whatnot and charged less I think it actually uh, worked pretty good like if you actually added hunting to it like buck commander a buck commander game had like deer hunting uh, like critter hunting coons and whatnot like you actually do have this in here you hunt uh, beavers and squirrels you only hunt squirrels like twice in this game I think but hey and of course the ducks like, it could actually, I think, bear its own against a game like Call of the Wild. Looks like Cy si caught a big one. Cy, si, did you catch another log? There we are. Oh, that's right. My other one uh, had the uh, code for the, uh, uh, like, extra clothes and John whatnot, Luke. too. Let's get in the blind. The, the tuxedo on Willie and the boa on Cy. Uh, si. Low dog. Oh, <laughs> that actually happens. Okay, well, let's get to the blind anyway. Bam. All right, beardless nephew. Like if you Welcome added like the pranks the and everything line. to go along with it is also. Thinking. Maybe You've even some guests get on, before. like, Bucky Man, they got some um, celebrities out there to hunt. Around. Yeah, Clint Today, Boyer, my friend, pretty sure Blake Shelton was out there. The sweet, was it Blake Shelton or uh, Jason Aldean? Swoon. One of the two. All done with this little guy. Now let me give you a brief demonstration Call, like, of Duck Commander right Nick Championship or something like that. And then that, of course, the fishing, because the fishing isn't a bad, it's not a bad mechanic in this game either. And there is definitely a wrong way to blow one. Let me show you the difference. Like compared to other fishing games Here's I've seen of recently like. that are like 20 bucks, like 
the fishing mechanics of, the, of uh, this it? game aren't that File bad. that in the what to do box. Now here's what you do not want to do. <laughs> Hear the difference? A good call brings more ducks. A bad call brings fewer ducks. We want to call in more ducks. CB, you've got a pretty mean call. Why don't you help old John Luke out a bit? So a call is made up of a series of notes. The key to a good call is hitting the right note at the right time. Here, I'll show you. Now you give it a try, John Luke. That's good. See if you can do a couple more feed calls. Try not to miss any notes. Good. That's some fine calling. Now you've learned the feed call. You can use this call to get ducks that are right above you to land near your decoys. Hey, there's some ducks coming in. See if you can call them and we'll take it from there. Quack, quack. I think I hear them. Get in here, you little Get flying ready, buzzard. Chase. Ain't gonna find a better shot than Jace. Well, except for Phil, maybe. Tell you what, John Luke, I'll let you do our calls for the rest of this hunt. Why don't you help Jace out and call ducks in for him to shoot? Hey, there's another flock All over right, there. All right, let's go. Get ready, Jace. We used to have a mallard named Henry when we lived, lived in Tennessee. And uh, he used to act like he was a dog. Wow, it keeps migrating oh, for some reason. Look, more ducks over there. there. We go. Get ready, Jace. The siren call. There we go. Redneck right. poo, man. I think that'll do for dinner. <laughs> ba boom, 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 boom. You can call him in good. That's step one to killing ducks. Step two is shooting. Jace, why don't we see if John Luke can shoot? Oh, that well, song. come on. Let's head out to the shooting range oh, then. Song. Come on, John Nothing Luke. Like Hop in the ships. truck. All right, so we're getting in the, we're getting in the vehicle. Let's go. Oh, yeah, you can change the station. I don't like this song, John Luke. Do you mind changing the station? Well, I do. Oh, there's off. This ain't bad. Great station. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, whoa. He's a little different with uh, PS4 Let's control of the shoot. Xbox. We're going to walk over to the range. Like, you got this weird pan thing going on here? All right, John Luke. Let's start with the basics. Damn, why we set up some bottles for you to shoot. Take them down one by one. You've got to aim down the sights to get a bead on your target. Yeah. Not bad. The bottles ain't ducks. For one, ducks like to move around. We're like, going to throw some bottles in for it's you. Like, Try it the over. Fly. It's weird.
six pack. <laughs> Try waiting for the bottles to get close to cross and pass. It'll make it easier for you to hit both of them. Arch hit area to hit multiple targets. Good. Boom. We're gonna try something a little harder. This is like bowling when you've gotta hit that 710 split. Shoot one bottle, then pull out and aim down the sides to hit the next bottle. You'll snap to it quicker than just keeping your cheek on the stock. This is the I fastest way to move your shotgun sights from one side of the blind to the other. Weird that it keeps panning like that. Like, weird pan. Alright, here we go. Darn! Missed one. I think one of the goals is to not miss any bottles. Oh yeah, that's a good sign. Red Nick Crew, man. Did anyone see my glasses? I lost them when I was throwing bottles. Well, I might have tossed them at John Luke, considering those things are thick as soda bottles. Yeah. You can't be a Robertson without knowing how to hunt ducks. This is a weird pan You've already learned duck on. calls and shooting. Now, like, you just got to put them together. Pans. John Luke, hop in the truck. Here, doesn't. Your turn to drive. Take us to the duck blind. All right, let's go. Where are your pans again? Okay, Cadet, it's time for you to learn the important parts of driving a motorized vehicle. If you want to use the brake, use the that bad in this important game parts. If you're out running the Viet Cong, you don't have time for brake. You think Charlie said, hey, here comes the test, let's put on the brakes? No, Jack, they went full speed ahead. John Luke, it's brake to slow down, accelerate to speed up. Give it a try. You've got waypoints on your GPS. Follow the waypoints to get to where you need to oh, go. Oh yeah, the they used to screw me over sometimes. It would be when you when it goes to loading, and then you end up like ten feet ahead and you're hitting something. And I think we're supposed to nope down here. What's this Irish music going on here? Then we don't have the uh, metal detector yet, but there is something to find with the metal detector down here. Whoa! Just spat Stop. us out. Hi. Do you see something? Or are you just shooting? Yeah. I want to get a peacekeeper like that, the little uh, rough rider. Well, which one is it? The when I turn 21, that's what I'm going to look at getting. Yep, go with him. What do I have to size it? Because you're the youngest. Boy, well, he hurt somebody. That doesn't make any sense. I didn't hear nothing. Man, the pan. It, there we go. It's like I couldn't pan over the thing. Yeah, that wasn't me, that was you. Hey, where's Sai? Sai, you trapped in the truck? Unlock the door and pull the handle. I guess he's not coming. Okay, John Luke, let's hunt some ducks. First thing, you gotta keep an eye out for him. Look for a flock. Look directly at a group of ducks and lock into it. You can move your camera away from a flock at any time. Center the camera on the flock and press X to call it. Why do I sound like Bill Murray from Cat, uh, Caddyshack? Shoot I'm looking at my controller for a second. forgot where the O was. Wait for the ducks to reach your decoy spread. Some will land on the water. When they do, start shooting. Light them up. It's perfect time to start shooting. Hold L2 to aim and press R2 to fire. To quickly move from duck to duck, simply aim again towards your target. Alright, boom, here we go. Whole flock down. Not one left to tell the tale. That's alright. You'll get the hang of it. Alright, I'm gonna keep quiet. What do you mean I just You try calling them in and shooting them on your They're own. They're all dead. There's no way this is illegal. 
Each flock has an interest meter. Fill it up by performing calls. Perform calls, fill up the meter score. More. Oh. Almost forgot. In time, ducks lose interest in your call. If the interest meter empties out, the ducks will leave. How did y'all not hear that? Time for you to die. Let me teach you the greet <laughs> call. When you see ducks further in the distance, you need to use the greet call instead of the feed call. It sounds like this. So try it out on the next flock. Look right at the flock you want to call in. <laughs> Didn't really need to do that, but what's it all that? Well, you only need a few left, so. That's some fine. It's all John Luke. My tutor is starting to pay off. Not that I've played through this game uh, seven and a half times. <laughs> That's a long cutscene. I'm looking for used dogs too. I don't think even uh, call. Hunter Call of the Wild We're has dog hunts anymore. Or yet. Alright, time to meet up. <laughs> Excuse me. Well, this is good. Some good jams here. I'm looking at my cat right now. I've got two storage containers in front of me, in front of the uh, huge flat screen I'm playing this on. Yeah, it's Coda. If y'all haven't seen Coda, then uh, I'll show a picture right here for y'all. This would be a heck of a lot easier to uh, edit, too. Now I'm just using the voice. I don't really need to do a face cam. Some games I like to use face cam, some I don't. Like Arkham Knight, I'm not really going to start using face cam anymore. But I, I do want to use it up until the point of uh, when we go to Miyagani Island and find Manbat. Like, I want to get my reaction of the Manbat encounter on uh, record. See, where we. What? It, it said back there. Why? Oh, uh, what the crap? I thought the thing was right there. I guess not. It's weird. Oh, it must have just been the next waypoint. There we go. Willie, when you literally just started, it won't be ready for a while. We still need all sorts of things to make a big dinner spread. Hey, you just say the word and I'll go out there and the next thing you know, boom, bow, bow, bow. You got a spread of the finest order here. Yeah, everybody I'm happy, so happy, happy, happy. This is going to be good. You know, I just love cooking a big meal together. It really brings the family closer in a loving way. Ah, uh, don't touch that. Willie, you just got served. Yeah, well, I wish I just got served. It's funny listening to this. I'm like Miss K was trying where harder than most of the guys on here. Speak of the devil. Hey, buddy, where y'all been? Oh, you know, just showing John Luke over here how to be a master duck caller like his uncle. Ha. <laughs> Good. Well, we're going to need some ducks later for this gumbo for sure. What y'all been up to? Oh, you know, just being awesome. Yeah, what is that? The use. Must be my mom's The use? Nobody says use. Yeah, they do. I've my never kids heard say it all say the that. time. No, nobody says that. Sure they do. I just said it. Whatever. Y'all are ridiculous. Been like that all their whole lives. If they ain't competing, they're eating. And right now, we ain't doing neither. So what gives? Whoa, whoa, Festive. whoa. Slow down, Boys. Turbo. Hey, y'all ain't gonna believe what I just saw. A psychiatrist? Hopefully you just saw your psychiatrist. No. I just seen a beaver dam the size of a house. I'm talking about like the White House. But hey, it was brown. So it was like the brown house. 
So is this like when the wolves chased you down and your shoes caught on fire? I know what I've seen. I actually lost track of how well, long I've been playing. I need to. You bet you we probably do. Probably do the beaver hunt well, sir, first and then uh, That's the only go ahead and cut it off there. Let me guess. You can't remember. No. I forgot. Oh, boy. Here we go. I'm afraid he might need more than a psychiatrist. So I may need a brain specialist. No. Well, what you gonna do, sir? I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm going to war with those little rascals once I find them again. So what's the plan of attack? Well, I'm glad you asked. First on the agenda, fill up the iced tea glass. Second on the agenda, take a sip. Yeah, so far, so riveting. Hey, and finally, I'm going to take that ATV and go find them again. A lot of build-up, but just didn't deliver in the end, did it? It's scary that we're related. Well, if you're going out, try and shoot some squirrels for the stew, I'll okay? I'll try to ask girl out of okay. work. And take John Luke with you. Very he can learn a thing or two from you. Wait, did I just say that? Come on, John Luke. You and Cousin Bo will be in my platoon, soldier. Time for Uncle Si to teach you three of my favorite things, driving and shooting. Well, what's the third? Good question. It's a tie between using the bathroom and napping. Here, John Luke, take my rifle. Si, show him how to use it. Silas Merritt Robertson, reporting for duty, over and out. Oh boy, John Luke is in for it. I mean, at least we know that using the bathroom and napping are tied for Si, and he's not doing them at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Ow, that hurt. Stop it, Willie. Don't make me pull your hair out. I'll do it. And that's a lot of hair to pull. Okay, okay, fine. Time to go. Let's get to the dock. Let's go. Si, Pretty sure I'm still good. Do you ever change your socks? This car smells like a roast beef that got left in the sun all day. Should be right. No, there we go. Okay, at least it doesn't throw me into a tree as soon as it's done loading. Oh, there we go. Didn't hit it. Good. Should be right... yeah, here. What? Like, see, it kicked me out of the car. Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah. You found a signpost. You can find different signposts near the roads or in more remote locations. Read them to unlock rewards. You can see all the collected signs in the tokens page of the menu. Richard Kiley, I am we'll not... We'll take the boat from here. Get in. Oh, uh, what's Fast that? ways by water. Oh, what Hop the? in the boat. Oh, the Lord. The Lord. <laughs> There's nothing there. Okay, you have unlocked a reward. You can view all available rewards by pressing the touchpad button. Touchpad. What the? Touchpad. Touchpad button to continue. Yeah, no. Uh, resume. What the crap? All right, and we're back. Uh, we'll that was weird. From here. Get so, in. Fastest ways by water. Hop in the boat. So, option. Oh, there we go. Options. So, controls. Resume. I'm trying to think. Should be something to. Uh, oh, I guess because it's I'm not on my own. It's the main story. I was going to say, go ahead and check it out. The John boat operates a little differently than the truck. Forward and backward are the same, but changing direction is a little more challenging. Not really. Let's take a little detour. Here we go. After this beaver hunt, I'm going to go ahead and duck out so that I can... Uh, Get everyone ready for church. <clears throat> yeah, game mechanics aren't that bad. 
I mean, I've actually never had a glitch in this in the Xbox 360 version, but uh, that was the first glitch I've ever ever experienced. Hopefully, it doesn't happen again. We're gonna ram this sucker right in! Ooh. Hey. We're almost there. Oh, we're gonna do the squirrel hunt first, okay. I seen a few of them rascals over here. And then, this is the place. Oh, nearby sign. Let's go ahead and click that. Oh no, not this again. No, not this. Okay, so apparently this is a glitch. Um, oh no, here we go! Oh, I forgot. That uh, you can press the middle thing, like the middle thing of the blue light. I'll take a picture of it here to show y'all. Oh, so that was uh, where I messed up. So now I can equip all this. So, truck horns, new gun. Okay, and then treasures. I have found no treasures, no frogs, and two signs. A beard is recommended beyond this point. And have you seen the ninja? He's right behind you. And then, of course, you can also check the map. Look at that! That is so weird! Like, it is scrolling too! That is weird. And then if you do a thing, it doesn't move. That's just weird. You unlock the new shotgun. Use blank to switch through shotguns during each hunting, shotgun, golf, or ball, uh, bottle shooting. Each shotgun has a different shooting style. Experiment with them to see which one you like. So let's go over here and shoot some squirrels. Hey, where'd Sai go? All right, John Luke. Get ready for the squirrels. That rifle's gonna be a little different than your shotgun. Namely, you've gotta be more accurate. Get those sights right on the squirrel and more squeeze accurate. the trigger. All right, here we go. Nice shot, John Luke. You got one. You got him. Ooh, right out of the tree. Nice shot. That's dinner. Only a couple more to go. Yeah, only two. That's all. And only ten? Look at your dead corpse right That'll there among it. your brethren. Let's head out. Uh, you can't even spell squirrel without SI. <laughs> oh yeah, we're gonna do this thing too, apparently. The metal detector. One of our jobs is to help Sai find all the stuff he's buried out here and forgotten about. The last treasure of his I dug up, I found a small coffee can. Inside another coffee can. And inside of the smaller coffee can was a tiny container of unsweetened tea. It was like a Russian stacking doll filled with crazy. Fortunately, Sa keeps all his treasures in old ammo boxes. Why would you bury that? That makes them real easy to find with a metal detector. Why don't you see if sai has got anything buried around here while I go look for him? I, I gotta go find out where Sai like rushed right off by to. A tree. If he gets loose in the city again, Willie's gonna have my hide. Alright. This should be right over here. Go ahead and finish this up real quick. Jar of Vietnamese dongs. There we go. Dongs. Worth how much? I don't know how to read that. Or, oh, one dollar. Okay. Can't move that. Okay. Okay, so it's got Doug Dynasty logo car rims. 
There we go. Houston, there yeah, is a problem. Weird blue line Something going across, is going across a mile somewhere. We are losing water, and we don't know where it's going. We got big time problems here. That water was a no foot up on the oak trees right there, Si. In order to attract ducks, we have a levee system to hold pools of water. No water, no ducks. That ain't good at all. Whew. Ducks are like women in that they don't like a lot of mud on their butts. What we have now is a lot of mud. I see beaver signs, Si, all out in here. And bucktooth rascals. We figure it's if you go back way back in my videos and search up Jurassic Room Beaver, beaver. Burn the I actually down. seen the beaver He's once. He's the pelting plague. He's a log chewer, water joker, flat tail rascal. Hey, I hate them suckers. There we go. That's a weird, this way weird me blue well, line. Whoa, whoa. I guess it's where the face ends. Or something. Yeah, there yeah. it is. It's a... Sounds like trickling. That's right. And that's <laughs> the kind you do oh, in the I'm toilet. Sorry. That's the sound of a dammed up creek if I ever heard one. Where the face Which means like one thing, thing ends. Beavers, Jack. I can definitely hear it. Si, do you think this is the way to the big beaver dam you found? What do I look like? Amerigo Vespucci? Honestly, Si, I don't even get that reference. John Luke, we'll pick you up at the dock. Looks like we're gonna do some beaver killing. We're driving, you're shooting. Hurry up. Alright, let's go. First, let's go ahead and check out see check out the rims. Let's see if you see it. Yep, there they are. Duck Dynasty rims right there. And there's the cattle horns. Alright, let's go. Kill some beavers. This is absolutely insane right here. They started to build a dam here. Too bad for them, we discovered it. Look at that. I knew them little suckers were around here somewhere. They were trying to be sneaky and quiet, like ninjas. But we got them now. Now we gotta get these rascals right. out of here so we can blow up the dam and keep the creek flowing. That little thing? They're trying to hide. Don't let them get to the reef or we'll lose them. Crap, crap, crap. Like the pan thing is not that great on here. Pan mechanic. John Luke, on your right. There you are. John Luke, on your left. Where are they? Oh. He's growling. These things are terrifying. Oh, there he is. Gotcha. Yeah, it's a plague, all right. Over there on the shore. What the? Crap? They're trying to flee. Don't let them escape. What the? Jeez. Like I'm gonna have to do Good a job, John Luke. Let's turn back and see suck. if any of them are still there. Get those little suckers! Behind us? Wait, get there those little suckers! There you are. Gotcha. Ooh, almost got away. Is that all of them? Guess it's all of them. They retreated into their dam. Time to get the dynamite. Time to blow it up. John Luke, when I tell you, you push that plunger down and watch the action. This is what they call payback time. You do the honors. 
You got it? Yes, sir. I can do this. Get it done. Blow it. Hey, wicked. New dog. Good morning, <laughs> Vietnam! Now that's the way to take a beaver down, my boy. <laughs> Whoa. Saving. Beaver busting. John Lou, I'm taking Sai out to the dock. Miss K needs some frogs for dinner. Why don't you try your hand at catching some? Okay, I think we'll go ahead and try and catch some of these frogs. Then, oh, okay. And yeah, what's this one? Wanted. Wanted for chopping down a tree while Phil was sleeping in a hammock tied to it. Alright. So, right. Down here, I believe all you gotta do is. Okay, let's see. So get from this side over here. There's one right here. Don't you hop in there yet. Gotcha. I see you. I see you right there. Alright. How many I catch? Three. Okay, good. Shark decal. That's it. Good job, John Luke. I'm out at the dock. Let's do some fishing. Alright, so it's already stayed up and all that. I'm gonna leave it off right here and go ahead and end this video. And then the next video we'll go ahead and do some fishing. So uh like, comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching. <laughs> That's just to annoy them as well. Alright, I'm gone.